Welcome back to Inside. So, picking up where we left off, I think I need to slide down here and then jump before I fall completely and grab onto that pipe. All the while, zombies slash what I call servants are shambling in the background. Here we go. Yeah, it looks like there's a guard there watching the servants. Ooh, there's a ladder there. What's down here? I wonder if there's another one of those orbs. Is this a secret? Aha! So, apparently there's, like I said before in the last episode, there is apparently a secret ending you get if you get all of these, but the question is, have I already missed one? As thorough as I'm being now, now that I kind of no sort of kind of what to look for i have to wonder did i miss any before because this these are all the like save points so the last one i found was to the left in this save point you see the little grate there on the left that's where i found the first orb the second one's right here i have to imagine there probably was one somewhere here right i mean there's a lot of stuff but then again maybe not because that's the beginning of the game Maybe that was more mood setting and trying to make sure the player is kind of comfortable with the concepts and the controls and all that. I don't know. I feel like there's a decent chance I already missed one, though. Anyway, turn this damn thing off. <laughs> That's so cool the way it slowly falls over. Why? Somebody's recording something. We're playing something? I sort of hear music a little bit. Got something going on with a reel-to-reel -reel tape. Once again, let's see where this yellow wire goes. The last one just went into the wall. This one also goes into the wall. Ooh, spurs flew away fast. Speedy little buggers. Ooh. Oof. Oh, I thought I was dead there for a second. Nope, that was supposed to happen. Um, hmm. Can I drop down another level? <laughs> Ooh. Oh, kitty cat. Also, I'm dead. Also, kitty cat. Also, no, I can't drop down another level. I wonder if you could make it if you, like, jump just at the right time. Probably not. Wait a minute. I just realized how sad that is. The only way you ever get to see that cat is if you die. There's no other way to get there, is there? Oh, that's what I've been hearing, that like marching sound. That's all the servants marching. Who's controlling them, I wonder? I also wonder if there's some sort of thematic or maybe even literal connection between Limbo and Inside, because we've seen those worm things, right? The worm things and the pigs, and that they were sort of controlling them, or at least aggravating the pigs. Wasn't there some sort of a brain worm in Limbo as well? It's so cool.
Ooh. It's weird I break my legs there. Uh can I actually make that? Hmm. Can I drag the ladder? Ah. Cool. They're dead. I think. Maybe not? Do they sort of come to life? It's like they're getting shocked. Is it just when the light's over them? No, no, it's not the light. What the hell are those machines? They can't just be lights, they're more than that. <laughs> but I, I need the power on to use this, huh? Of course. Probably hide behind the pillars. why they're getting shocked. They are they are dead. It like instantly shoots. I don't know, it's like the world's largest uh, like taser barb. It's not to stun you though, it is to kill you. It's fucking grim. Seagull. This looks like another board that might break underneath me. I love this bassy synthy music. Makes me think of the thing in John Carpenter. Oof. Ooh, that is bending. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna load this game. I feel like this might be another place where there's uh, one of those orbs. I could probably jump over there, right? Right? What if I jump in just the right place? There's one board there, you see it? The one board that hasn't fallen. I bet it's doable. Nah, I don't think... I don't think you can. I think any board you jump on, it, it'll break. Okay. This is bad. Uh. Oof. Oof. Oh god. <laughs> Oof, I went a little bit far. I gotta, I gotta be just like them. Don't stand out, don't stand out. I guess if you stand out, that means you're not under proper control. I 
Was it like a jump test? Okay, I can do this, I can do this. Yes! Wait, I'm gonna have to jump again, aren't I? This is quality control. It's quality control. Wait a second, wait a second. The people look at the people in the back watching us. They do all have masks, right? But also there's people of all ages watching them. There's this sort of quality control person with the little clipboard, but there's also looks like there's families, like there's children, there's somebody carrying a baby. The turnaround test. Ooh, I was a little bit slow there. Oof. I guess I passed quality control, but just... Ooh! Just barely. Okay, it's not watching me anymore, right? But I mean, people are watching me. Right? I'm, I'm just gonna keep following them. Oh yeah, there's a dog back there. I just needed to stay put, but I guess not. I guess I need probably just run. Yep, just run. Oof, that's gotta hurt. Do they have faces? It looks like they have blank faces. Uh oh, oh, oh god. Oh no, 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 don't, don't bring me closer to the dog. Thank you, friend. Actually, hold on a second. I'm just trying to get a look at their face. Oh. Oh, they can walk through there. Hmm. Anyway. I swear they're wearing a mask, too. Like, something seems strange about their face, but maybe not. It's hard to tell, because they're so kind of just, like, blurry and indistinct. Probably gonna need this for something. Oh. Wait a second. How am I gonna get back to the control thing, though? Oh, I see what to do. Yeah, so here's what we need to do. Because I, I need to move this thing to a place where I can reach it without the box, which I believe is this thing. It's of a similar height. No, don't, don't go there, please. Yeah, that should do it.
staircase is coming off of this thing. Is there any use to this? I'm very curious about something. Can I get one of the servants in that thing? Oh god, what did that do? Uh... Look at how floppy that box is, I love it. But also, this is very weird and disturbing. I'm controlling a servant who's controlling another servant? What the hell? What did I just accomplish? It looks like there's a button directly above me. Um, I don't know what good that is, though. I don't see how I could... Oh, wait. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I see. Oh, wait, there's a problem here. I think if I make my servant, my direct servant disconnect, I'm going to disconnect myself and fall on my death. Yep. Hmm. How does that work? I need to disconnect it without disconnecting me or disconnect myself in a safe place? Alright, well, let's get the other servant back first. So I guess I just need to go back here. Now it's back. Okay, so I can't I can't control the other one at this point. I don't even know if I have to do this. This might be entirely optional. I don't know if I can just go down those stairs. Probably not, because I can't move in that direction. Um I Sort of... Uh, kind of have an idea? So let's get this thing going again. I mean, we can just do this, right? Yeah. But I didn't actually need the second one to do that. I could have done that with just one. So... Right? So what's the second one for? Oh, I need one to hold it, right. Okay, I see. So this... This needs to be over here so that I can drop down without dying. So we do this... Oh, oh god. I almost just ran off the edge because I was looking at the character I was controlling up above, not the kid. Then we do this, and that one up there stays on the button, and... Push ourselves through. Okay. That's a pretty cool little puzzle. Oh. Just like a... Construction people. Just wearing hard hats, I think. That definitely surprised them. I think they're calling for, for help. Um, okay, so I need to fall down there, I believe. So I probably want to be, like, here, because it seems to close pretty quickly. Beautiful, beautiful water can. Oh, look at those. There's a name for them. Those, like, reflect, reflecting, refracting light waves. Like, wave caustics or something. Underneath the water. Oh, right. I can't. I can't dolphin out of the water. But, like, yeah, the water is just gorgeous.
I see a thing I can grab. But first, let's look for orbs. And yeah, look at those reflections. Not just underwater, actually. You can also see them from the water on the underside of that, like, I don't know, refrigeration unit or whatever that is above me. So pretty. Trying to see if I could flood this place with water. So just open automatically. Yep. <laughs> Look at all this old refuse. It's a bike there. up that far. Okay, there's a lot of things here. There's that open door. I want to make sure I don't miss anything. There's the chain. There's also over here. So take me back down to the control room. certain there's an extra thing here. Probably one of those orbs. Maybe the chain? Oh! It closes, right? It closes when it fills up. So the chain is probably where you're supposed to go? Well, no, then again, there's no way to get it right now. I can't jump out of the water. I think I think I have to go through that open door. While it's open, of course. So I think I just gotta run for it. Hope I can get there fast enough. Look at the way the the kid's just like looking up out the window. So cool. wasn't even close. Is there something down here? Oh, maybe I need to do the reverse. Oh, crap. Maybe I need to get over there before it drains. Yeah, there we go. Wait. What about that chain? How do I get on that chain? Hmm. Unless there's something I can, like, drag back from here? Let's see, I'll go, I'll go ahead a little bit. What's out there?
I should do it. see people on the trains. Yeah, you can see them on the trains, or I guess not on the train, but actually just on the train, like at the train station. I'm just thinking, like, at first this world seemed almost downright, like, apocalyptic. Everything being so gray and doomy and gloomy and just trying to hunt down a kid to murder them. and all the infected pigs and everything. But like this world is, is to some degree functioning. I mean, it has people doing quality control, right? So there's like people actually setting up processes to to handle these, these servant people. There's trains, so there's like infrastructure, there's public transportation going. There's power and I don't know. I'm just thinking. Let me check something. Now I was just checking to see if there's anywhere else I could put that huge suitcase thing to maybe get to some bonus area, but I don't think so. Look at all those people. All those servants. What am I going to do as soon as I get down there? Oh, I can hide in the shadow. Gotcha. Oh, I love the fact that the shadow moves too, because the angle's changing. Okay, there's, there's a really, really cool and absolutely tiny detail here. So this light, I don't actually know what the light is coming from exactly, right? Is it, can, is it one of those camera weapon things that like shoots me with a barb and kills me or, or what? I don't know what the actual machinery looks like, but they've put in an, an incredibly tiny detail into the light that is, is, I feel like, pretty hard to notice. Somehow I noticed it, though. Every time it reaches the end of one of its cycles, like it goes all the way to the right and then stops, or goes all the way to the left and then stops, when it stops, it doesn't just instantly stop. There's a little, like, bounce. There's a little bounce to the light. Like, the piece of machinery that it's coming from, reaching the end of its track, is, like most pieces of machinery would kind of do, is it, it bounces a little when it reaches the end, right? There's a little bit of give there. I'm just thinking, that's such a cool detail, because that had to very specifically be put into the game. That wouldn't just be there, randomly. Like, that had to spe somebody specifically put that into the game and program the light to have a little bit of wobble at the end of it. So yeah, take a look at that light when it reaches the left side again. And then when it reaches the right side, a little bit of wobble at the end. Little ka-chunk. you see it? Let's watch it again. So cool.
They almost sound like they're sleeping. Or grumbling or something. Uh oh. Oh, oh, no. Oh, another shadow here. I missed it before. I just tried to lift it up while I was on it. Needless to say, it didn't work. Oof. Oof. Let's see, did it save? No, it hasn't saved since the beginning of this whole section. killed me. Did I miss out on something there? Because I could have jumped and probably made that beam, right? I don't think I would have been able... I wouldn't have been able to jump up far enough to get on the other side of that floor up there. So no, I don't think I missed anything. tunnel, I guess. First I thought it was a sewer, but no, it's not a sewer. And it still hasn't saved. Dear God, please save. It's not like there's a fucking monster down here. I see dogs back there. Still hasn't saved. Guess they heard something. Okay, now it's saved. Thank God. Alright, I think that's a pretty good place to end the episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.